Shavua Tov, a Gutevoch. I want to tell story number 111 of the Shibchei Baal Shem Tov, the oldest source of Baal Shem Tov stories ever published. It's rather a very short story. And stay tuned for a few uh, notes on the biographies of who these um, characters of the story were. The title of the story is Rabbi Nachman Mehorodenka Belevia Sabal Shemtov, Belavaya Sabal Shemtov. Rabbi Nachman of Horodenka in the funeral of the Baal Shemtov. In Hebrew we say Levaya, which is to accompany, to go with the um, body in its final um, destination to the cemetery. So the funeral march is called a Levaya. Levayas Habal Shemtov. And this story, even though we will continue telling many Baal Shem Tov stories, the book is not necessarily chronological, um, this story is after the Baal Shem Tov passed away. I heard from the Rav of our community, that is uh, Rav Gedali of Linitz, right? The Rav of the community of the author of the book, that in the Levaya, in the funeral of the Baal Shem Tov, after he passed away, Rabbi Nachman of Horodenki, as he writes Horodenki here, Rabbi Nachman of Horodenka, uh, was very surprised. How, why, were people not seeing anything in the spiritual realms? It looked like a normal funeral. He was surprised. As they were coming closer to the Beis Achaim, literally the house of life or the house of the living, which means the cemetery. Then he started seeing not a terrible things or, or, or fantastic revelations. This godliness was being revealed in front of him as they were marching toward the cemetery. And he said this to Rav Zev Kotzis. Of the kids, as I think I've mentioned him in other stories, and said, surely, or it obviously needs to be this way. He was surprised that there were no revelations before. This is the Baal Shem Tov's funeral. Something major has to happen in the spiritual world. And so, is the very brief one paragraph story. Um, Rabbi Nachman of Horodenka was born um, some 18 years before the Baal Shem Tov and passed away uh, like five years after the Baal Shem Tov. He was one of the Talmidim, one of the disciples of the Baal Shem Tov and eventually he would also be related to the Baal Shem Tov when his son, Rav Simcha, would marry a granddaughter of the Baal Shem Tov, the Baal Shem Tov's daughter, Edel had a daughter, um, Fega, who married uh, Simcha, the grandson of Rabbi Nachman of Rodenka. Um, they will have a son after the passing of Rabbi Nachman, whom they will also call Nachman, who will become eventually the famous Rabbi Nachman of Breslov. Um, Rabbi Zeb Kitzes, I've uh, mentioned him before, Maybe I will bring his uh, his biographical note uh, next time. He's also one of the early uh, Hasidim of the Baal Shem Tov, one of the, the uh, most relevant characters in the story, since he's in the stories of the Baal Shem Tov, since he was one of the uh, closest Hasidim during much of the Baal Shem Tov's life. And the source of the stories, of many of these stories, are uh, from the rabbi of our community, Harav Mekeil Asaino. And that is Rabbi Gedalia Rabinovich of Linitz. He was born uh, about uh, 32 years after the Balshanto, in, in 1730, and passed away in 1803. He is the author of a famous uh, Hasidic commentary on uh, the Torah, the, the, the Shuas Chen. And he was Rav in the community, in the Kehillah of Linitz for many years, uh, where the author of the book, where the Rav Dover of Linitz uh, lived. So he heard from his Rav, from the Rav of the community, many of the stories that he included 
in his compilation of Balochent of Stories. I am translating one by one all the stories of the ship Balchentov, this oldest source of Balchentov stories, and telling them here in the channel. And I'm also working on uh, translating and editing the text in Spanish, um, from the Hebrew to the Spanish, with the hopes to publish it sometime in the future. For that, I appreciate contributions, links in the description. Please, if you like it, give it a like, share, watch the stories, and come back next week. Prayers for our soldiers and all those who are suffering in Eretz Israel in these difficult days. Shavuot Tov, a good